Welcome to this brief presentation about the Kangaroo March reenactment, which will be held in September and October 2015. On the 1st of December 1915, eight months after the Gallipoli landing, 5,000 people gathered in Wagga Wagga to see 88 men from 16 years of age to 60 begin a 36-day march through to Campbelltown in Sydney. They travelled through Cootamundra and Juni and the communities of the Southern Highlands then on to Campbelltown and along the way recruited in total 222 men. A Kangaroo March reenactment committee has been established and it is creating this reenactment and inviting all of those who live in these communities and perhaps those of you who don't to understand what happened in 1915 and importantly how these events inform who we are now. Did you know that men and women across our history gave their lives for the freedom we've come to share? So let's tell our kids stories so they'll know the reason why we will wake up tomorrow and our freedoms won't be there. The heroes of our past have shaped our nation of today and who we are today will be the heritage of tomorrow. The benefits of the Kangaroo March and its reenactment will be manyfold, but it will include, of course, education and understanding of what Australia was like, what these communities were like a hundred years ago, to also give an opportunity for us to bring out the relics and the artefacts, the diaries and those precious mementos that are held by families, by RSLs and small museums in the communities along the passage of the Kangaroo March itself. It will also provide an opportunity for commemorative services to be held in the communities as the Kangaroo March moves through them over the period of the centenary. They fear not what may be before them in the incoming fight. Their only aim to keep intact freedom, sacred right. The right their forebears fought for, men all staunch and true. He will do his best and enchant the rest, this fighting kangaroo. The Kangaroo March is also establishing the Rural Commemorative Children's Choir. And what this does is it gives our children in these communities along the course of the march an opportunity to participate with one another in singing songs, not only from the era, but also new songs that are being written about what it means to us today. Of course, in giving voice to uh, an understanding of what happened uh, along the course of the Kangaroo March, it also prompts our children in these communities to think about the national significance, the significance of what it means to be an Australian today, 100 years later, from what these men did and what they gave for us in the First World War. It's a long way, boys are to see. It's often the case in life that the most important things seem to be funded by cake stalls and raffles and much of the funding that is needed for the Kangaroo March reenactment is coming from just that. But we also need the support of our local government, of our councils and the communities along the course of the march. We're also looking for individuals, philanthropists and companies that might like to be involved in this commemorative event. 
this is something that we should all own as Australians. It's a community driven initiative, but it also needs support. And if you can provide support to the Kangaroo March uh, reenactment, then it will be most greatly received and certainly invested not only in understanding our past, but of course creating our future. Honour the men with voice and pen who've come at Empire Corp, who laugh and chaff at war is wine cough while awaiting deadly ball. Lift your hats to the men who never again may see spot where their first breath drew. Cheer loudly tonight with centurion might. The man, the kangaroo. The Kangaroo March will also need the support of local businesses, schools, of artists and musicians, of amateur historians and those organisations and individuals that have a particular interest in giving meaning to the First World War in a modern context. In Flanders fields, the poppies blow Between the crosses, row on row That mark our place and in the sky The larks still bravely singing fly Scarce heard amid the guns below We are the dead, short days ago We lived, felt dawn, saw sunset glow Loved and were loved and now we lie in Flanders fields. Take up our quarrel with the foe. To you, from failing hands we throw the torch. Be yours to hold it high. If ye break faith with us who die, we shall not sleep though poppies grow in Flanders fields. To become involved, visit the Kangaroo March Reenactment Committee website and there you'll find if you want to, you can become a foundation member of the Reenactment Committee. You can make a donation, you can register your story and the story of your family, the story of your community. You can also register for the choir and a range of other things which will mean that you can play your role in your community commemorating not only the First World War but the sacrifices that have been made from the town in which you are living today. Yeah.